Well, you know, a group of veterans is stuffing hundreds of stockings for children of military families this holiday nice. season. I absolutely love this story. And uh, KXOY4's Grace Ditzler, she was with the group as they were stuffing those stockings with hundreds of toys. And Grace, boy, this sounds like such a special group. It is. Nadine, Chris, Combat Vet Riders is a veteran motorcycle group and they're collecting and donating toys to give to local military families. Their goal is to make sure military children have the best season of this holiday season that they could possibly have this year. On Tuesday evening, Nicole Thomas and other Combat Vet Rider volunteers were swimming in a sea of toys. We are collecting donations for Operation Homefront through the Dollar Trees and we are making stockings for military families. Operation Homefront is a nonprofit that provides emergency and other financial assistance to the families of service members and wounded warriors across the country. The toys come from donations from shoppers at local Dollar Tree stores, and the combat vet riders volunteered to put them all together. Then the toys will be sent all over our area. Military families in need, so it could be through different entities and different units, or it can just be an individual family that needs a stocking for their kids. The group estimates they have more than $2,000 Dollar Tree toys to stuff, but they say doing this type of volunteer work isn't new to the combat vet riders. As, as far as CBR's involvement, again, we're comprised of all volunteers, so whenever there's a good cause, we've got the membership that's going to want to be involved. And combat vet riders say it's all in an effort to make sure every military child, no matter what their family's financial situation is. We'll have a magical Christmas this year. Everyone needs to have a Christmas and all kids need to be able to have stockings. And Combat Vet Riders also participates in other, organi other organizations and um, fundraisers along with this one throughout the year, including adopting military families, providing them with gifts and other necessary household items. Reporting on the Sky Deck, I'm Grace Ditzler, KXLY4 News. Great.